morning. We are leaving the Relax Inn. It's really a cheap motel, kind of dirty, kind of dumpy, but got to look on the bright side because it kept us out of that storm and it had a bathroom. The shower was gross, so I just took a sponge bath, but having a flushing toilet is always a plus. So we are going to get back on trail. Adam wants to stop at the gas station and get pickles for a snack for the road, or the trail I should say, because it's a bit fifth wheel because we are walking on the road, but the trail is actually on the road. We're gonna be going under the highway and then finally into the woods. I'm hoping for Adam's sake that the rain knocked down the pollen because the allergies have been really bad lately. All right, see you in a little bit. Here we are. And I didn't know today was gonna to be a landmark day. It's very, very hot. We're really trying to drink water, but guess what? We are one quarter of the way to Maine. Yeah! Holy crap. Hey, guess what, everybody? We're hiking in the rain. It's not pouring on us, but the thunder is happening. And it's raining. And it's muddy. I don't know if you could see the trail, but it is muddy. And we are 0.4 from a road which is going to take us to the quarter way in, which is a hostel down the street. And we are going to wash our clothes, get clean, eat, dry off, and spend the night there. So I'm kind of trotting along because you know how much I love hiking in the rain. Right, Adam? What's going on? How much do I love hiking in the rain? You love it. I love it. So anyway, the uh, trail is kind of downhill, which is a good thing. Although, you know, I just- There's an old fence right here too. That's cool. I've uh, slipped in the mud before, but I thought you'd enjoy coming along in the rain. So let me tell you something while we're hiking here. We stopped for lunch and I wanted to let you know that the trail, I mean, it was gorgeous. The um, rhododendrons and the mountain laurel all in bloom. And sometimes you come to a place where the rhododendron blossoms would fall on the trail and you'd think like you were a, a fairy princess on a, on a special trip because there was just petals everywhere. And then we had lunch and Adam, not even a half a mile maybe from lunch goes, mom, yeah, I don't feel well. I, I just want to rest for a little bit. So he lied down on a rock and immediately went to sleep. And he slept for, oh, at least 45 minutes. And I took a picture of him. <laughs> um, but I think he needed it. I mean, I've done it too. Sometimes exhaustion just takes you over out here. And you got to just do what your body says to do. And if it's rest, then you need to rest. So the rain is kind of just coming down lightly. I hope we can get there before the real rain comes. So it's gonna rain all night long and tomorrow too. So we'll figure out what we're gonna to do tomorrow. Anyway, I'll talk to you when we get to a hostel. I wanna show you this trail. It is just all, we're, we're soaked. <laughs> it's like, growing in on us. It's kind of funny. All right, see you in a bit. Hi, I'm just going to bed. Um, we are at this fantastic hostel and it's called uh, Quarterway Inn, meaning you're quarterway into the trail and it's an inn kind of, but it's a hostel and it's, oh, it's so lovely. We are slack packing tomorrow and we'll be here again tomorrow night. So, um, I will give you the tour tomorrow, uh, and you're going to love it. It's really nice. And, um, the breakfast tomorrow is supposed to be fantastic. So I'm kind of excited about that too. Anyway, everyone, 
we had a good day today. We got rained on, but you know, part of the trip. And I got to take a nice shower, have clean clothes, all of that. So it's all good.